Sarah from Spire Laser. Imagine we are looking for a fiber laser marking machine for jewelry making, and we submit an inquiry on Alibaba or whatever. Probably we receive five or more quotations from different suppliers, and the prices may be very different. Then we wonder, is the same machine? Why does it come so many different prices? Today we are going to talk about the matters on prices. The deciding factor for prices will be the configuration. It includes the laser source, scanner, machine model, shipment control system, and others. The first one is the machine power. It's a common sense that the higher the power, the more the cost. Let's take the fiber laser marking machine as the example. You can see the prices range over here. It's a portable model from 20 watt to 50 watt. And you can also check the configuration in the details. On the same power is the brand or type of laser source. For fiber laser, IPG will be much more expensive than Rikers and Max. Even if it's the same brand and power, the models will get confused. Like Rikers, 20 watt QS is the cheapest, and then QE and QB. For CO2 laser, the RF mental tube will cost higher than glass one. Scanner, which is also called the galvanometer, like the fiber laser, Sino is the most popular brand and these models are various. You can see the two pictures over here. The first one is practically cheaper and the second one is higher. Other brands like Oya, Galvatic will be around the same cost at the second thing. Machine models on the same configuration, the enclosed one will cost higher than the open one. You can see the comparison here, it shows the differences. For the open models, no matter it's portable or desktop, the price will not range much. Control system, we commonly see the EasyCAD software. If you don't have special requirements on the functions like autofocus, 2.5D, the standard authentic system will be almost the same. The shipment. Here is the shipment rule you can check, but it's just for reference. Actually, prices for laser marking machine has been very practical since last year, especially for the low power of fiber laser. We can hardly find quotations which are likely to bluff the price. But if we are still confused on the quotations, we can list our specific configuration and ask prices from suppliers again. Thank you for joining us today. Do you want to know more prices on laser machines? Please put it in the comment below. Please subscribe me here, and I will see you next Tuesday here on my YouTube channel. Bye.